Hi friends, I am Dr. G. Nagendra Babu. You know me better as author of uh, Comprehensive Study of Organon, a book on Organon released in 2009. Now I am coming with a new book, Introduction to Homeopathic Metromedica. Uh, in 2022 this year, I have released uh, this book also through a reputed publisher, B. Jane Publishers. The need for the book came into my mind after uh, teaching Metromedica for around 23 years. I came to know that uh, Metromedica, especially homeopathic Metromedica is little different from other Metromedicas because you cannot read homeopathic Metromedica and you cannot uh, go to the soul of the homeopathic Metromedica until unless you have a thorough knowledge of other uh, homeopathic subjects like philosophy or even on a Metromedica. So I thought uh, for a new beginner, a newcomer, uh, young students coming into homeopathy, they need a formal introduction to homeopathic metromedica to master metromedica. And I felt that uh, such book is not available in the market so far. Uh, we have to collect different chapters from different different books and different different authors. And most of the homeopathic metromedica books are based on drug pictures, not in preparatory stage of homeopathy for the newcomers. So I thought uh, I'll. Uh, fill this niche in homeopathic literature and came up with this new book. I felt after collecting so many uh, chapters or so many subjects on introduction to Metromedica itself, I found that uh, this book came out to be very well. I am very happy with the outcome of the book. And uh, this is also useful to uh, both uh, undergraduate that is BHMS students as well as postgraduate that is MD students. Uh, when you go through the book, you will find majority of the introductory chapters have been covered by me. I was fortunate enough to get a foreword for this book from uh, Dr. Bipin Jain, Principal and Academic Director, HOD Homeopathic Metromedica of uh, Dr. ML Dawale Memorial Homeopathic Institute, Palgar. And I am very thankful to Senior Professor uh, Shripad Hegde, Director Tattwavada Research Centre, Bangalore. And uh, he also retired professor and HOD Government Homeopathic Medical College Hospital, Bangalore. And down south, the very famous uh, homeopathic uh, professor and uh, PG Director, PG Coordinator, co coordinator to uh, Sri Sarada Krishna Homeopathic Medical College, Kulasegaram Kanyakumari. Dr. Winston Vargis. These three people have uh, liked the book and they have given their uh, foreword and they have uh, a lot of prizes to this book. This book is a compilation of uh, so many uh, introductory topics which in my opinion has to be uh, read elaborately to understand the drug picture and to apply the Metromedica in their practice. So this book is an attempt to uh, prepare the people to the forthcoming study of drug picture to the full extent. I have written this book uh, solely for the students, keeping them in mind, especially PG and UG students as well. Uh, the, the language which I used is also deliberately I used a lucid language so that the newcomers can also easily understand. So I would just like to go through uh, the contents of uh, this book uh, to make you abreast with what I have covered in my book. I will try to give an uh, introduction to Metromedica, especially what is Metromedica and uh, how was the Metromedica in uh, uh, pre hanumanian period and during hanumanian period and post hanumanian period. I also try to differentiate Metromedicas of other systems like even Ayurveda, Siddha medical system, Unani medical system, Greek medical system, how these Metromedicas are different from homeopathic Metromedica. Of course, elaborated and uh, descriptive differences between allopathy Metromedica and homeopathic Metromedica has been governed by me. And uh, the beginner, especially the newcomer into homeopathic field, the uh, UG students when they enter into homeopathic studies, they will come across a uh, few terms which are new to them, which are totally different from them like uh, dyscrasia, miasm, 
modalities, uh, aggravations, ameliorations, habitats. I have made an ad industrious attempt to cover up all those uh, terms which are used in homeopathic metamedica. I am very sure and pretty sure after reading this book, each and every student can understand the importance of understanding these terms which are very useful in the study of homeopathic metamedica. Of course, none of the study is complete without knowing the history, the principle behind the subject, nature and construction of every science. Same thing applies to homeopathic metamedica also. Yes, I have given an introduction to history, how homeopathia metamedica came into existence, how it is different from other historical metamedicas. So there is a big chapter which is dedicated to such subject. Uh, topics like uh, sources of metramedica, the source books of homeopathic metramedica and how to read homeopathic metramedica which is a very important and challenging subject. For a newcomer when he reads homeopathic metramedica it's very tough to understand. I know every chapter from Akkonet to Jinkamet will cover from group study of uh, remedies third year and final year students are very keen on this subject yes i have given how to approach and how to read and how to collect data for understanding uh, group remedies in metramedica i have added a separate chapter relationship of homeopathic remedies the relationship between among the remedies like antidoting remedies that follow well uh, surrogates kind of things i have tried to elaborate in this chapter Relationship of Materia Medica with other sciences is also very important because Dr. J. T. Kent says you cannot master homeopathy or the practice of homeopathy unless you understand the three subjects Organon, Materia Medica and also Repertory. Three of them must go in hand in hand to make your prescription very perfect and true. 12 tissue remedies introduction has been given how to apply them in our practice and I've, of course I have added for PG students applied metramedica. Homeopathy was born as a art and later it has been made into science. So every step in homeopathic metramedica or in homeopathy is intended to apply to the patient. So metramedica is not an exception right. So I have added, especially useful for PG students and doctors also as well, Applied Metramedica in Learning and Practice is a chapter which will be really helpful to you. How to apply Homeopathic Metramedica in our practice. Given a note for vowel nosodes and of course backflow remedies to make the book almost complete. For a newcomers, how to write how to master metramedica is a great challenge. So I have to give a sample. At the end of the book, I have given a model drug picture. After reading all these introduction chapters, I have given a chapter at the end. Model drug picture. I have taken Lacus as an example. And elaborated study of a drug picture has been given at the end of the book. Uh, UG students, you really cherish it. You can enjoy it. Yes, to make your work very easy, at the end of the book, I have given a list of remedies from each group. I have added an appendix, list of drugs from different, different families and groups I have added. Uh, it's like uh, eating banana, easily. I have kept the banana. As I stated earlier, uh, this book is written solely for students in keeping in mind and their need especially in their preparatory stages of uh, how to study metramedica.